Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you a small trick to make single line paper, double lines, grid lines. I had teachers who work with me search on internet to find four lines so that they, uh, they can paste it in the word and print it for the students in worksheets. You know, the space between, the gap between the lines were too much for them. They wanted the space equal, but it was hard for them to find. So uh, it's very easy. You can do this with Excel. I'll show you how. So let's open an Excel sheet. As simple as this, only one thing you have to do here is that you need to select the uh, cells. Like for example, you want these many, okay? And you go to borders. You can see more borders. It will be there in the home button near the borders. You can go to more borders. When you go there, now, for single line, you're going to select red color and you're going to put the first line, okay? And then you're going to use the blue color and do the next two lines and you're going to press okay. Now, you're going to have the line here. Now, you can uh, see a print preview if you would like. You can see the lines over here, the red and the remaining the blue. You can set margins and make it in the center. If you want a margin also, you can do the same thing. You can select only this column and go to more borders again. And just use the red one and click on this side and press OK. So you will have a margin already. So when you look, this is how it will look with a margin. And because this margin looks so big, what you can do, you can reduce it so that, you know, the margin is smaller than the remaining space. It's up to you. Now, let's clear all this. Delete, I'm deleting all of them, all the cells, okay. You will select four lines, one, two, three, four. And you will go to more borders. So again, you will choose the red one and you will click on the top and bottom. And you will go select the blue one and click in the... Okay, now it's four line. I'll show you the print preview. You can see it's four line. You can adjust the row height to the height you want for these four lines. And you can copy and paste this again to the remaining lines. and paste it for the, you can see how it comes to the next line and you can do the same thing or you can paste the, copy the whole thing. And I'm going to paste it again. So see as many cells I've selected, it's going to come. So this is how you can easily make a four line. You can do the same thing for double line. So again, I'm going to select all these and delete it. Delete, I'm deleting the cells, okay. Now for double line, I go to borders, choose the blue one and press, and I'm doing it only in the middle and I press okay. So I have only the double one here. So I can copy this and paste it here. And I'll show you the print preview version. You have the double lines. Okay. Now, when you set the borders for math, you will have to put all borders. You can select the color you want. Let's say it's blue and select it on all sides. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then, okay. I'm just going to select these and make them a bit bigger. A little bit more so it looks like a math paper somewhat I just need to adjust it again so using this technique you can create any kind of paper you want single line double line even graph paper you just need to reduce the columns and the rows and you can make graph paper also and you know you can put border for the graph so it's clear for the students 
So it's easy this way to create. You don't need to spend time searching. All you need to do is take and open an Excel, do this, print it, the paper is ready. So that's all for today. I hope you all understood and uh, you like this video. See you in another video. Thank you.